So today we are, oh, I just punched you in the boob. <laughs> was that your boob? It's a little bit. Oh no! Today we are exploring a really interesting place. It's called Fairplex and it's fairgrounds basically. So they do the LA County Fair here and they also have like horse races and other types of events going on here. Do they do like car races too? Yeah, there's like the drive races, horse races. And it looks like there's a concert here. So. Yes, I'm performing. Yes, <laughs> us. Come see us. Let's yeah. Show. <laughs> Some history on this place that we just read about is pretty interesting. So there used to be an asylum before they built all this. And there were a lot of murders and different things that happened in there. And there supposedly are still tunnels. And I think we found the stairs to it but we're gonna try to get down there. I mean, I don't know if, I don't know where else that would go. I'm assuming it goes down to the tunnels or something. So if there's abandoned tunnels from an insane asylum here, that's gonna be really interesting and insane. So I hope that we find, I hope we find it. I hope that's it, watch it not be it. It's just like a wine cellar. So let's explore this place. I hope you guys enjoy this video and enjoy going on, oh, and enjoy going on another adventure with Ashley and I. Guys, we just heard something in this ice box. I don't know what it is. What do you think it is? Oh my god. Who is that? Oh my god, it's Tyler. Tyler, how did you get How did you get here? Wow, I thought you couldn't come today. Wow. Does anyone need any salt? Maybe some pepper? Oh, look, they have tapatio in there, I think. Oh, look. Are you hungry? Is anyone is anyone hungry? How about you, ma'am? Or sir? Sorry, oh my sir. God. Oh my god, how old is that? It got stuck. <laughs> sir, would you sir, would you like some Mmm, yeah. Oh, we're about to see the world's largest what is it? Train set? Garden train set. Very specific. How far does it go? Look at that, you guys. Daddy, I want it. It goes like all the way over there. Uh-huh. All right, guys, you are looking at the world's biggest garden train set. <laughs> it's based off of California's history. Oh, they have the Golden Gate Bridge. How cute. There's a mini man. Wow, he's hot. Dang, bro, you, you good looking. Who needs a drone, guys? I just got this. Look at that. Drone shot right here. I even got King Kong on my drone. <laughs> what other drone shots do you see like this? Yes. Oh my god, I got Goofy in it too. Wow. Do you think this hotel is haunted? <laughs> Comment below. Let us know if you want us to stay there. We might squeeze in a little bit. They would have police officers in front of Randy's Donuts. <laughs> Guys, they have a graveyard. We must go explore it. Where's my spirit box? Are there any mini spirits with us? This place is huge. Even if we don't find the tunnels, it's still really interesting to look at everything here. There's also been deaths due to horse racing accidents, car accidents from racing on the track, and then the asylum murders, of course. In 1920, Pomona's California Colony was opened as a remote location for inmates who were considered potentially violent towards themselves or others. This facility handled the criminally insane and was originally designed as a measure of restraint and isolation from the rest of society. Early in the year 1921, the CRIPA investigated the asylum due to reports that were filed with the state of California about inappropriate care, accidents, unexplained deaths of inmates and staff members, and inefficient medication use. In December 1921, a mass murderer was committed into the asylum. A man named Mark A. Mangler, who was an inmate diagnosed as criminally insane after murdering 17 co-workers at a Riverside shoe manufacturing plant. 
He was sent to the California colony for restraint and seclusion to protect society. Just after a month of residing at the California colony, he and other inmates went on a killing spree. A total of 23 staff members and four inmates were killed this evening, and there were 45 inmates reported as missing and were assumed to have escaped that evening. Mr. Mangler was never found. After this incident, they immediately shut down the asylum. Then in 1922, the LA County Fairgrounds were built on the site. After 80 years, a big discovery was made by construction workers in 2006. They discovered that there were some boarded up tunnels that led to a still intact portion of the old California colony. Some of these tunnels still remain to this day. The tunnels are said to be extremely haunted and many people feel the presence of a man named Mr. Lanterman who died in 1981. He is said to be one of the many wrongly killed and tortured inmates and wants people to feel the pain that he felt living in that asylum. So it's definitely haunted. I don't know if we'll catch anything on camera. This will be more of like an exploring vlog than a haunted video, I guess, because we don't have all our equipment and it's, it's in the middle of the day, you know? It's, I mean, if you guys hear anything or see anything, please let me know. Yeah, we're gonna try to go in the tunnels right now. It, there's no sign saying we can't, so. Watch this not be it. Oh, we're gonna have to like duck. <laughs> oh, what the heck? This might not be it, guys. A false alarm. What is you that? Just jumped out, disappeared. Right? I think I'm really close to it. Oh, I don't think this is it. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Shoot, where is it? <laughs> like, how did you get here? Oh. I really thought this would be it. Well, that was anticlimactic. <laughs> Um, so it led to the other side of the track, which that was not the tunnel entrance. So we're asking someone right now, and I think he's giving Tyler directions. I think he knows where they are. Maybe we'll find them, you guys. So Tyler and I went under there, we were so disappointed. We were like, I stayed up top. I was like, mm. yeah, she was like, mm. you guys can go first. So the guy literally told Tyler about every single tunnel that exists still because they boarded off some of the tunnels to make them smaller and whatnot. There are so many freaking tunnels and we're going to one of them that is open to the public apparently with cells and everything still from the asylum. So let's hope we get in this one. Guys, I think I found it. What the heck? Guys, I found it. Freaking way. Guys, these are the actual cells. Oh my god, I have the weirdest vibe in here. This is weird that it still exists. How crazy is this? <laughs> Guys. That would not keep me stuck in there. I could kick that down. <laughs> yeah. oh. well, you gotta remember it was 1923 when it closed, so. So apparently, there's a man that haunts this area named Mr. Lanterman. I have the gnarliest headache down here. Like this place is insane. What is this? Probably oh, just another way in. In? So it's like a normal I hallway, think it keeps thing. going, doesn't it? The whole wall comes back down. Look how creepy this is. Jeez, that's hard to breathe in here. Right? Do you want to get the necrophonic app? Okay. I'm gonna see if Mr. Lanterman comes through. <gasps> Miss, Mr. Lanterman, are you here with us? Oh my god, my camera got really... Right as that happened, it was like a man's voice I've never heard come through before. Yeah. Mr. Lanterman, is that you? What the? 
Like, I've never heard these voices. Yeah, me either. Can you show quick. us? Quick. Did he quick. say quick? What the hell? Did you hear that? Guys. That came from a cell. That came from the cell Are just you, Were you in one of these cells? Five. I'm morbid. Five? <laughs> Isn't there a cell five? There's 20. There's five over here. It sounded like it was like, I'm morbid. <laughs> yeah, it did. It said, I'm morbid than five. Guys, this is the cell I opened. It's number five. Sound like you said mine. Mine? That was like an old voice. Go home. Hey. Do you want us to leave? Did you hear that? I lived here. I lived here. <gasps> this is, I lived here. You lived here? Were you in one of these cells? Am I in one of your cells? Did you hear that? Yeah, there's something creaky. Like that. It stopped. Guys, we are hearing the weirdest things. What were you down here for? <laughs> what was that? That was a ghost fart. Oh, it was a fart. <laughs> we all feel like so dizzy and lightheaded in here. Like even when I went by the door, I knew it was it because it felt so weird. I was like. Can you show them how thick the door is? This, yeah, the door is so hard to open. We thought it was locked. I don't mind the freaking door. <laughs> Look at that. Tell me what cell was yours. Stay? Did it say stay? Yeah, someone said a number, but it, this one's one. one. <gasps> so. Number one's oh. over there. Oh, I feel weird over here. Is this. What the f? Is it could get up to Oh us. my. Are you mad that all the storage is in your cell? Yes. Is this a yeah? You said yes. <gasps> what? That's moving. Guys, that just moved. Is that you, Mr. Lanterman? What the f That really like started over here and then it went that way. Okay, I literally just heard someone <gasps> breathe behind me. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> it literally went from here to there. Okay, we get we need to get out of here. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! What the hell? All right, we got out of there because that place is gnarly creepy. I can't believe we found it. Like we, <laughs> I cannot believe we found it. I really thought maybe we wouldn't find it, but we did. I already feel better being out of that room. Don't you guys? Yeah. That's so weird. Oh look, we could go on a little carnival up here. Or a carousel, not a carnival. <laughs> we could go on the carnival. You hey guys, we're taking a detour, looking at the Donald Trump chicken with George Washington in the back. <laughs> Ashley's words, not mine. <laughs> Alright, we kind of gave up on finding the rest of the tunnels, but we found the insane asylum ones, which is crazy. Tyler's showing us like an abandoned motor home or something. I'm not sure what he's showing us, but these are really old, like horse stable buildings or something. Oh, what the heck? It is an abandoned motor home. That's so weird. Like, why is it here? Yeah, that was obviously in here. What? People used to be here. What the heck? Yeah. Night shift. They would play music. <laughs> well, they had the address too, so I'm wondering if that's still there or not. I'd be playing a brain in back. Do you recognize this person? Right? The cat's yeah. so cute. One of them was like trouble in the back. Yeah, trouble. <laughs> oh, 93. 93. Oh, Wait, 93. Wow. Do you think this has 92. been abandoned since then? Looks like it when you go inside. Like, 
if it's bad enough. Oh, wow. Oh, this thing's moving. What the heck? They left like everything. I wonder what happened. How weird. Guys, it looks like it has a face. Doesn't it? <laughs> it looks like it has a face. What do you guys think the story is of this RV? They left like everything in the RV. The door's like closing. Oh, the door's closing? We actually went all the way back into like the bed area. I did. And they have a bunch of like soaps from like those towels. I'm like, wow, yeah. they have collectors. Yeah, they have like a lot of stuff. I wonder if they were running away from something and just left their RV here to yeah, run. Got here. Look, the license plate is from Illinois. 07. So this has been abandoned for like years. Mm -hmm. I think they were running away from something. They went from a different state to here. I don't know. All right, guys, I think we explored the entire place, which this place is huge. So props to us for exploring this entire location. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys are subscribed. Also hit that notification bell so that you guys know when I post and check out my merch to do that because it's, it's lit. And I will see you guys in my next video.